Hi, Super Series here, back with another or no markup video, episode 13, and I've waited several days to be able to get two more factor boosts, but before you do that, we can get two more incrementy upgrades. Manifolds are 26% more effective, sort of an odd amount, but whatever, and reduce manifold requirement scaling. So I've actually seen what this does, and like this is, you can see like it increases by three every time, now, it only increases by two every time, which means I can get more more manifolds. I can get these two. We can probably realistically get the 64 times, but I'm not sure how much waiting that's going to require. I don't think it's going to require that much waiting as, as at like 66 times, but I'm, I'm not sure how useful the extra new manifold is going to be. I'm, I'm just going to wait. So, yeah, see you in a bit. Okay, I'm back way later than it should have been. I thought it would take um, just a little bit to get the 64 times. It took a, it took a day and then I didn't have time to record. So yeah, almost an E24 incrementy. It's I'm so close to E24 incrementy that I I I want I want to get it, but at the same time, like like this is what I mean by this. It's so tempting to just get the next little thing. What do I even need? I need 6E22. That, that's only in a thousand seconds. That's only like 20 minutes. So I'm just going to wait that. And No, wait. That's no, that's 6E21. Oh, okay. That means it would take several hours to get this last bit. So I don't really need this last bit. So I'm, I'm just going to do it at this point. Gain 43 boosters. This should be... This should be enough to get some of the challenges completed. So so now with the boosters, I have... I have, I have enough to get many different things. So I feel like I should be able to get... Maybe, perhaps challenge 3. Um, third time. That's what it is. Third time. And if I do this, I'm, I will need to, why can't I check? Okay, there it is. And if I do that, yeah, unfortunately that resets like you're, you, like if you're in a challenge. So first things first, need to get this because it's an odd number challenge. And then I don't think I'm gonna need this, which means I think everything is just gonna be like this, get, getting this build. So getting this many ordinal point or this many factor boosts allows me to do stuff like this. So, yeah, it's, it's, pr it's pr pretty crazy that I can reach something like this. So I need E256 ordinal points in base four. I'm not sure how how tough that's gonna be. I, f I feel like that could be, could be really tough or may not be that bad. So I am currently at E219, which isn't the most promising. However, I can um, get the the dynamic multiplier up to 10,000. It doesn't take that long. I'm not sure if, if it's possible, e even despite all this, even with all these incrementing upgrades. I have a 10 times multiplier to my dynamic, dynamic factor output and cap. So even with that, it looks like it's going to take a while if I can even do it. Like, how am I supposed to reach E256? I think, oh wait, I, I see what it's going for. To reach E256 ordinal points. I mean, also, it's interesting, it's almost looped back to red. But anyway, to reach that many ordinal points, I need to um, get all the way up to omega squared times 2 plus omega um, times 3 plus... Um, three and it takes it's gonna this is gonna definitely take a while it, I, it it takes I think if I'm calculating this right 256 times the amount of time it took to get this yeah that's a bit of a problem but I can, I can get that that does speed it up by about 10% so um, and of course a d dynamic factor but it, it caps so quickly that it's worth it to get every little boost you can here so I'm just gonna wait overnight and hopefully I'll beat the challenge. So yeah, see you in a bit. Okay, so it's been another day and I can finally complete 
this challenge. You can see, look up how far it goes. It, it's crazy. But yeah, we can we can complete the challenge. It's another challenge complete. What are we already up to? We're up to all these three to three. I feel like challenge five is gonna be the next one. So with a ma maximum of two factor shifts, that means that I I think the build I'm going to need. The base is reduced by four if it's over seven. So I feel like I'm gonna need this because it'll be eight. So it'll be down to base four. So I'll I'll just do the same exact build as I did before before here, and this this build should hopefully get me this goal in this challenge. I don't think it's even gonna. I don't know how hard it's going to be, but it may be really hard, it may be really easy, I, I, I'm not sure. So, I need E136 ordinal points, and since I, I since I can't do a factor shift, it's, it's going to be a little tricky getting there, but I don't think it's going to be all that bad, because I'm going to need something around... Omega to the Omega squared plus Omega times 2. So it's going to be something sort of like the last challenge. Except the E128 ordinal points, I actually do get um, get more factors. But I'm not even sure if I need that. I don't. I really don't think this is going to be that bad. Like I, I really... It's, it's again, it's going to take just several hours, but it's possible. So, yeah, seen a bit. Okay, so I can finally beat the challenge after getting this this many ordinal points and I'm not exactly sure what I should go for next maybe challenge 6 maybe challenge 7 not actually I feel like challenge 7 is probably the one to go for because I only need e18 ordinal points and since I can get more of the like booster upgrades and all that um it, it'll be it'll be interesting it's how, how I can get more, yeah, I, I, I can't, even, I can't even speak. I, I, I feel so for challenge seven. I'm gonna need. I think, unfortunately, I can't use this, but I think, I think, I'll be able to afford everything here, and then these last couple rows. Yeah, just barely by four boosters, and if I use this build in challenge seven, that should allow me to get, um the amount I'm, I'm going to need. So I, don't, I can only get two factor shifts. So there, there, is the, there is the waiting to get one million ordinal points, however, combined with, I think, some other stuff as well. Like you have to, because challenge six, I, I keep forgetting, because the dynamic factor drops and you keep no ordinal points on, on an infinity. So that means I think I just have to wait and then get this and then yeah I'm just gonna wait here. Actually, whatever. I don't. I don't even need to wait because I get that many um, ordinal points on infinity. And there's the challenge. That was actually a very easy challenge to get. The third one only cost only is e20 ordinal points. And I feel like that's actually possible with this build because. I mean, even when, I'm not exactly sure. Like, you keep no ordinal points on Infinity, but I I was getting E18 there. So, like with with this, and just, you just I'm just gonna use that utilize the enter trick, and then I can already get E18. Um, hmm. But I can't. Oh, I can't even buy factors. That's that's the problem. I thought it was gonna be a lot easier because there's barely an increase, and I could just spam this over and over again. But no. It looks like I'm gonna need more boosters to get the third completion of this challenge. I probably I probably need this because I'm not sure exactly sure my dynamic factor is, but I'm I'm gonna need more than what I already have. Or I should probably get something like the base is reduced by. I I have no idea what I should go for. I I I, I thought I could get this challenge. Whatever we got challenge seven completion. I may go for just a challenge six completion. Um, I can't buy booster upgrades. What does it? What does it even mean by? Cause I don't, don't I already have these? This is this is confusing. I'm I'm just gonna try one more. Um, ooh, okay, can't do that. I don't even need the um, that one anyway. Get this. This I think 
Oh, okay. Well, I, I think this is a slightly better build anyway. So, I don't know why it keeps saying you can't buy booster upgrades, because I have them. So, that that's sort of, that's, that's a weird wording there. And honestly, I, I can just get the first few factor shifts done without any, without any trouble. And, okay, I, I, I get this. Just, it's just the first infinity that is tough. And I'm, I'm even getting a little bit instantly, but like not quite. You can see I, I can get like, like the number a little bit to a, a decent bit here. It's, it's interesting how I'm just, it's, I'm just alternating between like challenge completions and, and, and just like, also why, why can't I buy, why is it not buying these? Do I, I must have my auto, they're, they're on, yet they're not buying these weird but anyway we, we only need e108 um ordinal points for this not exactly sure oh the base is five and that's a problem like that that's the real problem the only way i could do this is a base of five and i would just have to spam this if i ever want to get anywhere so this challenge currently is impossible unfortunately there's just many that are impossible at this point. I feel like challenge eight's the one to go for at this point. So I'll, I'll just I'll just try that next episode because this obviously is not getting me anywhere. Unfortunately, I I really thought I could get a little bit here, but I I thought I could get this, but I I'm gonna need a different build or different except the things you need a base of five five for this and i think getting th actually i'm just gonna try this is completely useless so that means i i could instead i can just i can just use this build for challenge six what was, what was i what was i even thinking this is so much better like it's i i have no idea how i didn't think of this earlier because because this gets me it, it is just so much better I'm telling you this this is gonna be this is gonna allow me to easily beat this challenge. That's that's what I think. It's because I'm just gonna be getting more ordinal points and hopefully it'll be, I can easily do it. I can already get this, just get this and then get this, get this, get the next factor shift. Hopefully yeah, look at this, E one oh six um, it's not buying that for whatever reason. Oh, because factor shift. Even though it doesn't even do much. And boom. Challenge complete. That is a lot more challenge completions. I feel like I can go for challenge 8 next episode. And then, yeah. It's, it's interesting. I'm now just down to a few challenge completions. I've heard 5 third time is like the hardest. I could even try 7 third time. It's going to be interesting next episode. So yeah, hope you enjoyed. Peace out.